it's a great thing which is happening that for the first time in history the idea of humanity is a, a reality we are already all in the same boat but what we lack is actually the oars you know and the engines which can direct this boat in the right direction technologies are especially good at automating routine work and increasingly many other categories of work. So it affects distribution of wages, but it's also affected the balance between labor and capital. Oblivion in the face of love. It is cheaper, it is quicker, it is faster, it is more reliable. They don't go on strikes, you know, they don't demand higher salaries. Um, they don't demand even bread and butter. No warning signs, no roads ahead. Just frequency. Production de toujours plus, destruction de la nature toujours plus, mais production de choses inutiles, de mauvaise qualité, junk food. Hein? Le système et dans l'absurde total. Savemos lo que hace la emisión de carbono y seguimos vomitando autos y dale que tarde. Y no importa porque se paralizan las cosas. Well, we have to rethink even the foundational uh, assumptions on which our way of life is built. So the idea of a, a universal basic income is one I think which is well, quite a wide appeal. It's a right. It's not a favor, it's a right. As a citizen of your country, the only thing that you need is, well, a heartbeat. <laughs> you need to be alive <laughs> and then you get it. La causa es el modelo de civilización que hemos montado y lo que tenemos que revisar es nuestra forma de vivir. Mis compañeros trabajadores Lucharon mucho por las ocho horas de trabajo. Ahora están consiguiendo seis horas. Pero el que consigue seis horas se consigue dos trabajos. Por lo tanto, trabaja más que antes. ¿Por qué? Porque tiene que pagar una cantidad de cuotas. La motito que compró, el autito que compró. Y pague cuota y pague cuota. Y cuando quiera acordar, es un viejo reumático como yo y se le fue la vida. Y uno se hace esta pregunta, ese es el destino de la vida humana.